James Wine is James the Wine Guy. In this video review, we're gonna talk about this beautiful wine. It is coming from Lodi, it's in so, and it's from Turley Wine Cellars, so stay tuned. Turley, a very well-known producer. Their signature bottle here with this really cool uh, point up here and a uh, beautiful, elegant bottle here and their very small uh, ribbon uh, label down here. So uh, this is Turley Bechtold Vineyard. This is uh, Lodi 2013 Vintage, 13% uh, ABV wine. And here's a back panel for your inspection here. Suggest retail $17. Keep in mind though, for Turley, is that uh, you actually have to be on their mailing list in order to be uh, you know, able to buy the wines. Uh, but that is a true bonafide price of $17. Now also keep in mind, uh, I heard a comment recently, someone say, well that's cheap. Uh, well, if you buy in the secondary, and what they're referring to is if you buy Turley on the secondary market, that is say uh, somebody sells their uh, lot to a, a wine retailer, well of course it's gonna be marked up, it's more expensive. But this is the initial suggested retail price point coming from Turley. Now, uh, so it's a really fantastic wine. I told uh, this was planted in 1885 with Sinso. Uh, really remarkable in that fact. And secondly, it's the oldest planting of Sinso on the entire planet. Fantastic, uh, you know, thing that uh, you find in Lodi all the time is a lot of heritage uh, vineyard sites. You have 100 different wine grape varieties being grown in Lodi right now. Sinso is fantastic, and um, I think it's a really overlooked grown variety, something that I think can pair well with so many different food styles. I'll say it again, I've said it before, you can pair Mexican food, Turkish, North African food, you can pair Indian food. There's so many different ways of serving this wine. Italian food, by the way, uh, pizza, burger, and so forth. Uh, you get the idea. It's a really versatile wine, beautiful acid structure, and uh, gorgeous uh, wine all together. So first, scent characterization, flavor profile, and the point score. So. Um, really gorgeous color on this, and, and let me pour a little bit more on my wine glass. It needs to uh, just really be able to open up even further and uh, to get those aromatics to flow through. So beautiful coloration here of cathedral stained glass window. So on this I'm getting the scent characterization that I would term as pomegranate, red cherry, raspberry, red flowers, tea, and additional notes of uh, cardamom. And next the flavor characterization and the point score. Beautiful notes on this include raspberry, black cherry, fennel, cardamom, violet, rose petals, red tea, and thyme. I give this one a 9.3 out of my 10.0 scale. Now please think of this as 93 points out of 100 points. And um, so this is a fantastic site, uh, Bechtold Vineyard. And what a fantastic year tasting from a heritage site like this. I'm very fortunate and I'm really glad to share this with you. I hope you get an opportunity to taste this wine. I'll put more information on the producer down below so you can contact them. And uh, please do me a favor, subscribe, give a like, and also share this video. You'll find me on many social medias, Facebook, Twitter, Vimeo, Google+, Pinterest, LinkedIn, as well as Instagram and WordPress. Thank you and salute.